To Michael Mosley is a journalist, science presenter and producer. He's well known for his programmes on biology and medicine, particularly his series on the workings of the human body inside the human body. Uh, last August, Michael was credited with popularising the 5 to 2 diet after appearing in the BBC2 Horizon documentary Eat Fast, Live Longer, which had a phenomenal global response. Now, Michael, along with journalist and author Mimi Spencer, has just published The Fast Diet, which outlines how intermittent fasting helps you lose weight and live longer. So, listen to this. The key to the book, in fact, let's welcome him. And uh, I was going to say, a quartering your calorie intake for two non-consecutive days each week. So, just run that by me again and tell me how that actually works. Okay. So, imagine it's Wednesday, as it is. Mm -hmm. On this diet, what would I be doing now on a Wednesday? Okay, so what I actually do is every Monday and every Thursday I eat 500 calories or 600 calories around there so I have breakfast yeah which consists of a couple of scrambled eggs and a piece of ham that's about 300 calories I drink loads of black tea water black coffee until the evening about seven o'clock when I have a pile of vegetables enormous pile of vegetables with a slice of salmon or something like that so you'd be skipping and that's lunch. a fasting day right yeah, I skip lunch so what do you do for lunch when you're feeling a bit pangy these days I don't because I've got used to it the thing about this diet I mean it's been studied now for 20 years by some of the world's leading scientists indeed one of the guys behind it is the most cited scientist in his area which is neuroscience in the world so it's not new What's new is that I came along and promoted it and did it. <laughs> and also what is new is the fact there are human trials underway at the moment of it. So it's not a gimmick. It's based on a huge amount of science. So just clarify yep. what you do then. You semi-fast yep. for two days two in days seven, and the other five days you can eat absolutely normally? Yeah. It's as simple as that. And that's why foodies love it. People like Hugh Fernley Whittington has just written about it, saying he loves it, because they can eat and drink exactly what they want five days a week and two days a week they eat what I've just described which is a light breakfast and a light supper. Okay, you're the scientist, you're the doctor, why does that work? The reason it works is partly because you consume less calories because you are actually consuming a quarter of the amount of calories on two days a week and on that basis just from normal physics you will lose about a pound of fat a week. You will appear to lose more than that because all diets, what happens is you lose mainly water at the beginning. So you appear to be losing loads and loads of weight and then you stabilise and that's because it's mainly water. On this diet you lose about a pound of fat a week and then you just constantly go on doing it. At a cellular level what happens is your system is being stressed because we evolved at a time when feast and famine was the norm. So 100,000 years ago, we did not eat four meals a day. We basically went off, we killed something, we ate it, we gorged ourselves, and then we ate nothing for mm. quite a while. And our bodies like stress. The reason exercise works is because it tears muscle. It stresses muscle, and then when you recover, you recover stronger. On the fasting days, what about sustaining energy levels? One of the surprising things is after about two or three weeks, what happens is you will find that you actually have more energy because they know that what happens, your brain starts producing this stuff called neurotrophic factor, which makes you feel good. They've detected it in every animal model they've tested, and they're just starting next week. They're going to start human trials of it. So what this stuff does, which is called BDNF, and they've measured it in all sorts of animals, is it makes you feel good. It's the